All right, guys, we are back with more Pokemon Xenoverse. Let's go ahead and sleep. That's how we're gonna start this episode. Ball's, Ball's daddy's big day. Now I think, you know, so I was thinking about my in-between videos. I was like, man, what's gonna happen here, right? Like, what's gonna be this event? Like, what's going on with those, uh, those fruits and stuff that people are like, that's weird. We didn't order dessert for this buffet. And I think it's gonna be a Xeno Pokemon event because we just did Team Dimension. So the only thing I could think of would be a Xeno Pokemon showing up and we battle them and then battle Wallace Daddy afterwards. Or maybe we'll see Wallace Daddy catch it instead of us. And that'll be his new ace. Those are my theories. So we'll see what happens. We're gonna jump right into it today. Here's our boy from the gym challenge. I hope we get to battle him, dude. I hope he's a champion. I would lose my mind if he's a champion. Joseph getting us all hyped up here. Maybe Gengar shows up. What the hell? He looks like um, the Red Kage. Can't think of the actual character's name. Oh yeah, let's be getting from the crown. It's actually in a song in here. I'm losing my if he raps, like in the text. That'd be so crazy. There's a Team Dimension robot up there. Ah, oh, the ones who ate those fruits. Oh, he thinks he's bombed. He didn't say his name. He's gonna please bring it up. Please don't. Uh oh. What's the, what's the evil laugh? What coincidence, huh? Let the events begin. I thought I could actually go back from that direction based on how they were standing earlier. So discussing what happened. <laughs> I was like, all right, oh. A weird purple Pokemon. I knew it. What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh my god, this... Oh my lord, why is it so big? Did it Dynamax? You're not calling... You can't call the goon squad from the other town. Not Mr. Don't call him Mr. Daddy. <laughs> the giant Slurpuff is killing me. Like, what in the world? Is this supposed to be like a Zeno one? I guess, I guess it is, right? Going to the Golden Studio. So it is a Xeno Pokemon event. I don't know if I really care about getting a Xeno Slurpuff. I ain't gonna lie. Maybe it's Poison. The Poison Fairy would be pretty good. I mean, am I wrong? That'd be pretty crazy. 
That's not how I get to the roof? Okay, it is. They made so many customs, like, the amount of time it took them to make this game is probably just ridiculous, honestly. Alright, so we're gonna save just in case we can catch it, and I don't. But the last few Xeno bosses we faced, we've not been able to actually catch, so. I wouldn't be shocked if it doesn't work out. Oversized noob. That's gotta be poison type, right? It is them! They're back already! Oh. Ah, so you don't upset about that. So that's my, those are my big old titties, buddy. How did I get here without the train? What? He broke the fourth wall. Why are we doing a whole dingy force introduction? So you've already accomplished that pretty quick. I was just gonna, I thought we were gonna get the battle in. That's why I thought, okay, I was like, don't, don't rob me of this opportunity. <laughs> they can't, they said they can't do anything, you can battle with us. Okay. Then so they get a one shot off screen and I've literally wiped off the screen. Let's do this. Oh my god. <laughs> it's poison. It's totally poison fairy. Man, I hope I, I, hope I catch it because that's going to be a nasty cutscene I have to sit back through. So 46, it's strong. All right, well, let's see if we can set up. <gasps> you bitch. That's annoying. Oh, they're going for stab. This earthquake? Is it poison ground? Do we have any full restores? I doubt we do. I have a max revive, that's it. All right, um, let's hope for a crit. We got one. You were holding drain punch on me the whole time? It's got three health bars, wait a minute. Okay, that Guts was gonna die no matter what, when it got toxic. All right. The hero of last time. And I didn't do nearly as much damage as before. Can we, can we paralyze it with force palm? Can we get lucky? Oh. Paralyze, will it do some damage? Coming for actually ate the earthquake up pretty well. I'm actually really impressed by that. All right, let's try and uh, let's try and bait into another earthquake. 
because Thor, it shouldn't be effective at all. And that shouldn't do much either. All right, what can Thor do for us here? I guess discharge on it. Okay. Oh shit, Thor. All right, now, now we're gonna discharge. We got the paralysis, holy shit, let's go. That sprite's so good, dude. It's so good. Dude, Thor might do this. Oh, come on, man. That's so lame. Oh, it's a crit. Y'all, Toxic's gonna kill it. Oh, it already died. Well, I thought Thor was gonna do it. For the Aerial Ace. The Paralysis. Another Aerial Ace. The, another Paralysis. Oh my god, we're paralyzing this thing to death. It's got- it's had Venoshock this whole time? That's actually really scary. Alright, let's go for an Aqua Jet here. Toxic, okay. Can't drain punch me. A Venom Shock would hurt though. Alright, I think I'm gonna try and throw a Xeno Ball at it. Dude, come on! This dude, this is actually uh, really annoying. Stop giving me bosses where I can't catch them. Like, legit. Like, that's not fun. gonna hide now or what? Is he really gonna get it? Is he gonna join the team? He really is gonna get the slurp off. These, these are things that only someone who lived in the hood can get. Uh, okay. So this guy Noivern as well. Thor could solo this gym. Alright, so we get to start our gym challenge. Pokemon Center.
I think we might teach Thor Thunderbolt. The game. What? Not, not Pokéless. Let's save. Because only you can prevent lost save data. And then we'll see if this theory is true here. So let's boot up Thunderbolt. I mean, it's just gonna be better than Discharge. You only buy 10, but. I do you think it's better? I wonder if Thor can get some coverage. Okay, it's still there, that's good. Like, could Thor learn Shadow Ball or Echoed Voice? Or Fire Blast? Actually, Dazzling Beam would be really good. We have no fairy types. No one can learn Dazzling Gleam. Okay. What about Skull? So Jaws can learn Skull, but it's not physical. It's not. It's a special attack. Huh? Can't learn Steel Wing. It's a flying type, right? Can this thing learn anything that I need it to? I guess we'll check Shadow Ball. Wow. Uh, am I physical attackers or in Dragon Claw? I have the worst TMs ever. Oh, excuse me. I have the worst. I have really good TMs, but like this stuff for my team, that's not gonna cut it, dude. Do I have any items that will boost uh, electric type attacks? Let's see, poison type, soothe bell, ghost type, water type. Normal type, flying type. Certainly doesn't seem that way. Dragon, I got dragon type. Oh, only once. We have the rock type one. Yeah, I don't think we have it. Okay, well, that is what it is. I mean, what can you do? Begin our gym challenge. I'm assuming he's sound type. You know it's time, yep. Yeah. No one can learn Dragon Claw on my team. Is that actually gonna work? I'll open Instagram right now on my phone. Actually pulls up a legit Instagram profile. They made so much art for that. I wish I could put this on the screen. The problem is, uh, a lot of them are not in English. Oh, they have English descriptions in there. Okay, so I guess I'll have all these posts pulled up. I 
Is that Guzma on, his, on the Instagram page? Sorry, I'm trying not to, um, I'm looking to find all the hints. I found one. Unless that's the main one I need. I guess we shall see. Can't talk to any of these people. I'm ready to start now. Oh. So these aren't trainers? Okay, I was like, um, you're not gonna... I like his outfit, that's cool. Is we really tough sound type? So Thor's a little under level for this, so we will see. We'll get Thor some levels. Really tough, so does it sound fairy? That'd be really cool, that'd be a good typing. Double edge, you killed yourself. Yeah, that's a good experience for Thor. I mean, Thor's kind of better like this, so... It's one of those weird things, it's kind of better as a half-dead Pokemon. I run to the rock room. Takes a long time, apparently. Okay. All right, so this, this actually is like on his Instagram page. How do you get them to move? Wait, do they not actually move for you? Huh? This is so weird. They don't move. So I thought there's an R key and get them to move. Nothing happened. Starting from the male dancer on the left, follow the steps that are in. Is that him?
Oh, I actually have to. It was a hint to your strength. This isn't working the way I thought it would. Okay. This is annoying, but I think I get it now. It's still not as bad as the last gym so far. Down, left, left. I can't move her. I get it. That was tough. The rock and roller. That was tough, man. I, I was dead silent. I was trying to make sure I wasn't going to mess up. Oh, I guess it makes sense. Kratoon becomes. I said Thor becomes furious. Gone forever, Cricket soon. Should be a nice level up for Thor. Got to level 50. Future Sight? No. <laughs> no way. I'm not Thor transformed because he's about 50%. Whoa! See what this does without stab. That's a crit. Resist. Well, super effective? No, we don't think it's gonna fucking kill you. This is Thor's time to shine, at least somewhat. There we go. Tina, not David, Tina goes down. After all that, you ain't got no ticket! Ridiculous. We are gonna full heal four. Because he's still useful without the stab going on. So, we're gonna go ahead and save wrap up today's episode, and next time we will continue and more than likely finish the sixth gym challenge here, as we have to probably battle the entire band. So leave a like and subscribe and all that. Sorry for how serious and quiet I got there. I was like not... I wasn't even looking. I closed the Instagram page. I'm just going to figure this out. Um, and I did. So it worked out. But we'll see you all next time for more Pokemon Xenoverse.